Are these posts proof that British elementary school students and kindergartners are being taught to tolerate sexual abuse? No, that's not true. There's no evidence to authenticate pictures of a brochure about strangers who approach, with the brochure saying, do not call him a pedophile. Posts about the brochure first appeared on a Russian social media platform, citing an unnamed Russian traveler as a witness and providing no corroboration. In another case, a post cites a witness with inconsistent identifying information. The English language leaflet depicted contains the kind of unprofessional grammatical errors that would be rare in a leaflet prepared for and by schools or social agencies. Further, the post making the claim does not show contact information anywhere on the leaflet. In posts making the claim, the location of the purported distribution of the leaflet shifts from the UK to the US and Britain, and then even further to any country that predominantly speaks English. Lead stories found no credible reports to confirm that such leaflets have ever been distributed to schoolchildren, an event that would be newsworthy in any context. The claim appeared in a Facebook post published on August 23, 2022. It said, quote, Warning disturbing in the UK. Children are taught not to be afraid of pedophiles but to be friends with them. Guidelines are distributed in kindergartens, which state, What do you do when a stranger approaches you on the street? Don't be afraid of him, he usually won't harm you. Don't yell and cry, it can hurt the stranger's feelings. Don't call him a pedophile, that's a dirty word. Try to get to know him better. He just wants to make new friends like you. Invite him over to your house. You can't imagine how much fun your new friend can have. These people are sick, their agenda is sick. What's next? End quote. The post came with a picture of the purported brochure attached to it. Here is what the post looked like on Facebook at the time of writing. Source. Facebook screenshot taken on Thursday, September 1st, 17 hours 28 minutes and 25 seconds 2022 UTC, a series of duplicate versions of the same claim about the leaflet on different social media platforms presented a chorus of mutually exclusive statements, full of omissions and contradictions. Contradiction number one. The leaflet as and also as not already in circulation another Facebook post of the pamphlet, published on August 18, 2022 contained a self-contradicting statement. It claimed that the photo of the leaflet was, from a UK primary school, simultaneously saying that it is not in circulation yet and, is due to be released this September. Contradiction number two. The purported UK pamphlet uses the American spelling of, pedophile, and uses Russian grammar definite and indefinite articles, like, the, a, and, in English are not a feature of Russian grammar and even cultivated Russians sometimes forget them when writing in English. In the purported English schoolhouse leaflet, the common phrase, the N-word, did not have an article in front of it, a mistake a native English speaker would be unlikely to make. Additionally, pedophile, is a U.S. spelling variant. In British English, it is much more commonly written as, pedophile. Contradiction number three. A purported witness, who appears middle-aged, is listed as 16 and her marital status is inconsistent on her profile. One of the Russian Telegram channels cited a social media account of a person named Elena F. Sitnikova as a source who saw the pamphlet. A search on this social media platform shows a single profile with this user's name. It is set up in Toronto, and the user's description contains serious discrepancies between the picture, declared age, 16, and marital status. Source vk.com screenshot taken on Thursday, September 1st, 15 hours 44 minutes and 44 seconds 2022 UTC. The page was translated via Chrome, on August 15, 2022. This account indeed shared photos of the brochure, clearly stating that the country where they were taken is unknown. Source, vk.com screenshot taken on Thursday, September 1st, 15 hours 44 minutes and 44 seconds 2022 UTC. The page was translated via Chrome. Omission. Posts describing the circulating leaflet leave out the municipalities where they were purportedly distributed other social media entries. For example, here and here, claim that the incident took place in, the US and Britain, at the same time but didn't name cities or particular schools. In some instances, for example, here and here, these pictures were shared without any textual description or references to a particular location. A TikTok video posted on Facebook said that, this is what they are handing little kids, 
conveniently not going into specifics on who, they are and when and where the alleged incident happened. The claim was also posted on YouGetTube, a YouTube equivalent video delivery platform that offers users a safe harbor and a guaranteed censorship-free forever experience.